And now over to Ireland. Chinese language and studies has been, has been approved as part of the Irish school curriculum. From September, students across Ireland will be given the chance to take this module. And CCTV correspondent Lorda Sexton reports on the transition year module offered and the demand for Chinese culture and language studies in Ireland. Ireland's interest in China is on the rise, and for the first time, Chinese culture and language studies will form part of the Irish school curriculum. The program, developed by the UCD Confucius Institute and the National Council for Curriculum and Assessment in Ireland, offers transition year students an introduction to traditional and modern aspects of Chinese culture, with some language learning. We send out 750 questionnaires uh, to all the schools and request uh, principals to complete those uh, uh, questionnaires. Now we got like 181 <coughs> returned uh, questionnaires. Uh, based on that kind of uh, survey, and uh, we uh, put together a report on the demand for uh, teaching Chinese as foreign language in secondary schools. Really the message, the result of the survey was uh, solid and uh, loud and uh, clear. So uh, there's significant uh, demand and the need for uh, teaching Chinese in the secondary schools. Demand is evident from the pilot program running for the past few years. Starting with four schools in 2007, last year saw 43 yes, schools yes, roll out the program and over 70 are expected this year. Designed by UCD Confucius Institute, the program is designed to be taught by Irish teachers, supported by online materials, a DVD and a handbook, with each school allowed to tailor make its course to suit its needs. The programme has been agreed with the Confucius Institute and with the NCCA here in Ireland and it's progressed um, in conjunction with um, input from schools with transition years over the last few years. It's currently taught by Chinese teachers coming from China itself but the idea eventually is that it will be taught by Irish teachers here. Um, UCD have a large input in the training of the teachers towards the eventual goal of having the Irish teachers deliver the course. The opportunity is there for them. There is now a large Chinese uh, studies department in UCD and also in uh, Dublin City University. And we have had some students who had um, taken the transition year module in Chinese and are now currently studying Chinese language in um, conjunction with a business degree course. A number of secondary schools are offering Chinese language to other school years alongside transition year, although it's not yet recognized on the testing curriculum in Ireland. Dave O'Grady, a physics teacher in Belvedere College, has a keen interest in China, having spent a year there learning the language, and has decided to teach Chinese as an extra subject on his curriculum. Irish students are certainly keen to be offered the chance to learn Chinese, and the hope is that it will